Hey everyone, today we're going to be discussing how to block specific sites from loading on Safari on your iPhone. So to block specific sites on Safari, it's really easy and it works fully on iOS 14 without any additional software. So first you're gonna open up settings and then you're going to tap on screen time. Now you'll see turn on screen time. You're gonna tap on continue and you'll tap this is my iPhone or this is my child's iPhone. Now you should see either a prompt to set up a passcode or you will just be taken to this screen. Tap use screen time passcode if you wanna quickly change your passcode. And so you're gonna enter your passcode right here. And now it's gonna ask you for your Apple ID in case you forget your passcode. So I'm just going to type that in right quick. Then you'll tap okay. And now you should have your passcode set up for screen time. Now you're going to tap on content and privacy restrictions and you'll have all these options, but we're gonna turn it on and you're gonna to wanna to enter your passcode. Now you can see all of these options are right here for restricting different areas on your iPhone, but what we want is the content restrictions, which is right up here at the top. So let me just tap on that. And now you have a bunch of other options on here for restricting apps, books, movies, etc. We want web content. Currently it's unrestricted, but we're gonna tap limit adult websites. What this will do is it'll automatically block inappropriate websites in Safari on your iPhone, but you have options to always allow a certain website to bypass the blocker or never allow certain websites to add specific websites to block on your iPhone. For example, if we wanna block Facebook, I'll add that right quick. Now when I open up Safari, and I'm just going to quickly navigate to Facebook right here, it says I can't visit the site because it's blocked. Now I can click allow the website and enter my passcode to bypass the restriction, but you have to know the passcode that you set up to bypass it. Remember, you can always turn this off easily in screen time settings. I hope this was helpful. Bye.